Maverick City and Dante Bo, let me address this. Maverick City put out a statement talking about them putting a pause to their relationship professionally with Dante Bo. Allegedly, there was some bunnies, there was some music, there was something that was going on that was inappropriate that took place with Dante. This situation has given fuel to all of the critics to say things like, this is why I don't listen to Maverick City. This is why I can no longer listen to Maverick City. The problem that I have with that is that we've become so hypocritical and this cancel culture is hypocritical. When someone falls into sin, we are so quick to throw people away. It's insane. And don't get me wrong. This is not a video to excuse the behavior. Because those of us who represent the kingdom of God, we must be held to a higher standard. Absolutely. Those of us who sing, those of us who preach, those of us who are in any type of spotlight, we have responsibility to make sure that we are representing God behind closed doors on the stage. This thing is not just a look. It's a lifestyle 24 seven. But for those of you who are saying that you cannot listen to Maverick City music anymore, you still don't get it. What don't you get? You don't get that you are exalting a man, a woman, individuals, and you're still not exalting God. If something can take place, if a person can fall and you can turn off the music that is supposed to be uplifting God, this shows that your perception is to exalt man and you're not exalting God. So before we try to cancel a group, Check your intentions in the beginning. Why are you listening to the music? Are you listening to the music because of their swag? Are you listening to the music because of the beat? What, what is the purpose behind it? We got to do better. We have to stop exalting individuals because individuals will fail us every single. Hello, everyone. It's your sister Roland, and all I need is a few minutes to talk about what's going on between Maverick City and Dante Bowie. He is one of the singers, well, was one of the singers in Maverick City Music. I've done videos about this group before. But, you, as you heard, the young man from TikTok was upset because of cancel culture saying that. He's more upset the fact that, you know, people were saying, oh, this is why I don't listen to Maverick City Music because, you know, what he did. And it was a not allegedly... It was an actual video of him dancing to Bad Bunny's music. And the music is called Después de Playa. So when it first came out, I knew about it. I saw the video and stuff like that. But I did not care to make a video well, that, until I heard this young man's commentary. Um, Dante Bowie has been doing problematic stuff. And it's not only him, it's several people in that group also. Dante Bo was the same one that made, he was in this video, this cursing video with Nicki Minaj, no, Meg Thee Stallion, I believe. Meg Thee Stallion, somebody else. Uh, very inappropriate video. And then I had made a video about him not too long ago. They went to a prison and he was wearing like a $250 t-shirt in a prison, mm, which is weird. But if Maverick City Music decides to part ways with him or suspend him or whatever they did, it's not for one thing. It's not because of this one thing in the bus. Because it, it, I believe it was like um, celebrations. One of his friends was how it was her birthday, and then they had a bus and stuff like that. And that's what they were playing, because they look Hispanic. The people that he was with, with mo the majority of them were, were Hispanic. So it's not this only thing that he did. It's several stuff, and there may be other things that we don't even know as the public also. But in life, where have you ever seen anybody you have enabled, anybody you have, um, you know, they did something wrong, you give them a chance. They give something, they did something, another thing wrong, you give them another chance. You give them another chance. When have you ever seen that person change? Don't they get worse? So at a point, when are we going to say, hey, you know what, I've given you several chances, it seems that you don't want to change. I'm going to have to cut you loose. This is what we don't do. We enable people. We enable people in their sin. And if you read the Bible, sometimes you have to cut the person off. And sometimes uh, you have to distance yourself in person. You know, you pray for them. You don't just distance them yourself like that. Of course, you continue to pray for the person so the person can see. And so, they get, so they're able to get out whatever they are in, which is mostly the fame that has gotten to him. 
the fame and stuff like that. Probably came too quick. He doesn't know how to handle it or whatever it is. But you pray for them from a distance so they could come and come to themselves in a sense. But enabling them mm, doesn't work at all. So it's not this only one thing. And me, I still listen to Maverick City music because they have some good, they have very good music. I still listen to their music. I'm not, just because I do videos about them, I'm not going to stop listening to their music or whatever, supporting their music. I still listen to their music. So people who are saying that, I understand that people are saying that, yeah, it doesn't make sense. And then you, they be saying stuff on the internet and then still go home and go listen to Maverick City music. Why y'all doing that? It don't make no sense. But whenever, if the person is habitually doing things, you have to do something different. You cannot keep on, you know, supporting them. Oh, I'm support you. I'm never going to let you go. And stuff like that. You're enabling them. You just, yeah, they're not going to get any better. And it's not only Dante Bowie. It's other people in Maverick City Music that, you know, been doing some, sus some suspect stuff. And we have to know that, hey... As you, as young man said too, um, we all sin, we all do things uh, that are wrong in God's sight. But when you are in the public eye, when you have a platform, when you have a level of fame, you are held at a different standard. They wouldn't, the way they hold Dante Bowie, they won't hold me or this young man at that level. So this is the thing. Anyway, that's all I have to say on this situation. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in another video. Bye.